Hi, inspirational dude with one minute of inspiration. You know that we live within the boundaries of our imagination. We live in boundaries of our beliefs. We live in boundaries of what other people think, other people's opinions. And yet, as children, if you go back to that time, we didn't have boundaries. We had unlimited imagination. We didn't care about people's opinions. We didn't have limiting beliefs. So, as a child, to where we are now growing up, yes, we have aged, but in the process, we've lost that unlimited boundaries. We've lost our imagination. Just think for a minute. What are some of the things you would really love to do? You've always wanted to do them. Maybe you wanted to do them as children, but now you've crossed them off your list with some story, no matter how elegant that story is. Whether I need to learn something first, whether I don't have the resources, whether I'm too old to do it, whether I'm whatever, whatever that story is. For a minute, think about creating a list. I'd say a hundred things, but if you can't do a hundred, do ten, do five, do six things, do some things that you've always wanted to do and really seriously look at doing them. Go for it. Yes, we are greater than our thoughts and our beliefs. Yes, it is possible. Everything is possible. But to not have it in our thoughts, to not have it as part of our vision, what's going to happen? Nothing. Make it part of your reality. To create things on your list, things you want to do, things you've never done. It doesn't even have to be some extravagant thing. Do something that is different. Do it locally, thinking globally. And then go global. Start to stretch your imagination. Start to go beyond. And think of yourself as a child, happy for no reason whatsoever, to be creating a wish list of what to do. One minute of inspiration. Cheers.